Hmm. So I avoided Muldrip's death. <laughs> but got 110 TV down. I don't know. 160 TV down against humans. He's got an ogre. Blodge mighty blow guard. A blodge movement seven thrower is actually pretty good, isn't it? He's got a losing record though. So. <laughs> yeah, BZL, that's a good point. <laughs> yeah, I'm not right, Ivy. <laughs> Right, so I guess it's a wizard then, isn't it? Simple. Yes, at least the sub ones work, yeah. Maybe. It wouldn't surprise me. Zero, zero, four. Don't want to mind it. I forgot this was pro tips as well. So I pretty much always go this setup for lizard men. Well, all, for almost every team. But especially with lizard men, obviously, because you don't want your skinks to get punched, even though he can go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and blitz them. So I think with him having fast humans, I'm gonna go a little bit different. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI. So. <laughs> One, two, well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, double GFI to hit one. Or can actually go like this. There you go. Now he cannot blitz a skink. <laughs> Ladies, gentlemen, and these gentlemen on fash. <laughs> oh, Senna 89, hello. <laughs> you can be my wingman anytime. Bullshit. You can be mine. Oh, cheers for the horse, Muldrifter. You can be my wingman anytime. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Just, Joe, I couldn't exactly set them up like 
10 squares back could I just to avoid a blitz? This is pretty much... Because I played somebody and he did just fucking make a GFI with a blitzer and cast a skink turn one. And it's, he's got the mighty blow. It's, uh, it's pretty easy, isn't it? <laughs> um, Mordred is absolutely... <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, Mo. <Mal. laughs> I'm sure you didn't just base everybody every turn and play like a complete fucking idiot, but just got lucky. I'm sure you weren't one of those, one of those uh, fucking Norse players. Um, all right, now I kind of <laughs> have to just put them all back at this line. Uh, You can potentially knock them all down, like. But, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI, GFI. Fuck it. <laughs> yeah, it is good to see. Good to see you. Uh, good to see you back, Mo. The good old half man. <laughs> Jump toast, I didn't say that. Yeah, playing for balls, you don't have to. Yep. Uh, ten games of Morgus, no, it'll just be one. <laughs> yeah, he would, wouldn't he? How about Senna in my German friend who's a good friend, but isn't as good a friend as Fashbinder was. No, Senna 89 is a much better friend than uh, Fashbinder, that's, that's true. <laughs> a much better friend. Oh god. Instant. Instant turn one source removal. Great start. Maybe we should try to push the advantage then without now that his guard's gone. And uh I can base his mighty blow guy even though he's got dodge. Could base him, blitz him. Alright. My attack. Yeah, that's the thing. He's strength three, isn't he? So he's uh, he's up shit creek without a paddle, basically. That's good, isn't it? Getting those two on there. Obviously, you can uh, you can make a two D with mighty blow, but if he does that, it takes three players, including the main guy who hit, would hit a skin. So 
Yeah, maybe I should have saved my own. Oh, there you go. So he just makes the dodge anyway. I knew, I knew he'd do this. I knew he would just make the dodge. Succeed the dodge. Kaz's skin. Unbelievably, he didn't Kaz. Outrageously didn't make a Kaz then. No doubt about it. I mean, it may have been the right play to, to make the dodge, but... Maybe I shouldn't... Uh... <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good, though. <laughs> No, I'm, yeah, I'm not saying that doing it first was the right play, but maybe, maybe making the dodge blitz with him was the right play. But yeah, not first. Yeah, yeah, I have to wizard. Yeah, I mean, he's done a good job of... <laughs> While he's done a good job of drawing the wizard, he's also done a um, done a horrific job of, you know, just simply losing the game if this bolt works. <laughs> so yeah, two swords tying up three was good, wasn't it? It's not, but I mean, I've got the wizard, haven't I? So I'd rather win two now. I'd rather win 2-0 than 2-1, wouldn't I? Right. So, safe moves first. What can I do? He blocks him, he blocks him, then one of them blocks them. He's free. He can block him on three dice, but all of this would have to happen first. So I'd probably save it a block with a source who can re-roll it. He should probably base him. Maybe he just blocks him. And then there's a... Uh... Then that frees up him for sure. I don't really like... I, I think I have to... I think I'm committed to just making the blitz first. Did an extra move for no reason then. Right, so he can get the ball and then go there and then he can come and kind of protect him. I guess the Crocs has to come. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, I can't get a guy there. Yeah, I'd like to get the crocs on him somehow. Right, so I guess if I were you, uh, I should I should try to get the skins freed up, shouldn't I? So try to get a pal, fish for a pal. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. GFI, GFI is just rotten. One, two, three, four, five. GFI. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Seems just horrible. So, yeah, he's got to go there, hasn't he? But then he could just block him. But he can't stop the assist. So, go for a block. To get the Croxy in. So put him on with that guy. Get the Crox 
something to him. Yeah, I didn't realize I had movement left. Right, oof. So yeah, the big two plus. That Ducky, Ducky saw. Um, so now these are all tied up, aren't they, on these, which is great. And I guess I could uh, make another dodge here. But he can't be one deed, he'd have to, no, he, he, he's gonna get two deed. So it'd be better to just uh, dodge him away, wouldn't it? Yeah, it, it didn't achieve anything though, did it? Putting him one. If you'd put him one near the one near the sideline, he can minus two D him and and then surf him. So I, I definitely don't want to get my croc surfed, and it wouldn't even be hard minus two Ding him with mighty blow. Would probably happen anyway. So. So yeah, putting him there, I didn't want to risk that. If I could have put him here, I would have done. To completely shut down the dodge. Um, but... <laughs> it's easy though, isn't it? It's easy when you men up and you've bolted. And you was shit as well. Also, the Crocs is in a position to make this as well, isn't it? No. Another pal. make touchdown fouls and that's very much like cheating <laughs> no I, I, the reason i haven't played them since the uh, ladder is, is on since like you know the champs ladder the championships are on it's like um i just don't think they've got a good chance in the playoffs is the real reason Fashbinder. Is that top of every race? Or just the top 16? I should have really saved my apple for that. Rather than use it on a miss next game, but there you go. Did you make that yourself or is it a thing? Is is that a thing that you can um is that a setting you can just choose on on uh on that site now fast? Wow. That's really good. You just one dice Kazdasaurus, just quietly. Right, so I want to block him and then block him again, but obviously want to make a cage. Of some description. Probably didn't want to make it there. <laughs> just quietly. I guess blitz from the crocs. After he pushes him in there and then base the ogre, I guess. Ah, oh. Beautiful. 
maybe I shouldn't have done anything with the with the crocs because he did have a tail on the bludge mighty blow but on the other hand he'd probably one dice block me and fucking cast me wouldn't he for several months now really how'd you do that fash League standings, yep, got it. Ah, oh, and then top race, brilliant. Oh god, that's amazing, isn't it? Holy shit, I've been doing all this, I've been doing all this work to see what the top of each race was, and I could have just clicked the button. Holy shit! So, a bit of a crap record for Wood Elves, then, eh? <laughs> one, one sixteen, lost two. We now in will top that at some point. Lizards in twelfth. So not a bad shout going for that. Humans have got a pretty bad record. Maybe I could go for humans, eh? But then the reason they've got a bad record is because they're shit. <laughs> now nah, he's going to base the ball. GFI to make sure. And the thing is, I don't even have fucking more players in him now, do I? We've both lost two. The only difference is I've used my app and he hasn't. <sighs> Holy shit. That one dice Kaz and the Kaz on the first ball. Pretty annoying. Especially as I should have saved my apple probably for this next game. Taken quite enough time. I mean, he's he's activated all, or he's used all of his players. He's got nothing more he can do. Anytime you're ready, fuck face. Because it gives it time to think. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Soros can be there. So put the skink there. Move to the skink here. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then a G five can be One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I guess I should have just tried to recover him first, but and I want him to move to there, don't I? So try and move him now. Oh shit! It's a GFI. Oh man, what a dingo I am! That was crap, wasn't it? 
Okay. Made a three plus dodge. Unbelievable, Jack. To say that <laughs> Soros got stunned and Soros got cast. This is, I should just call this team like the Four Soros team, shouldn't I? Holy shit. Thing is, Fash. If I had done that, I wouldn't have had anybody here. So, yeah, maybe I should have had the Saurus, the Crocs there, and a Skink here. Oh, maybe it would have been better. I needed somebody there, otherwise this guy just goes one, two, three, four, five, six, double GA five smack. So I had to have somebody there. But he, he could have been here. Oh wow. Come on, Lona fail. He just took it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> So now he just wants to go eight, doesn't he? I guess I don't even need. Uh... No, I've got the time though, so. Because humans are pretty fast, aren't they? I don't want to go totally crazy. On the, I like going on the sideline there, um, just because I can. Go a little bit further up, I guess. He gets in the way a bit, doesn't he? Do the blitz first, I guess, to see whether I follow up that block or not. I, know, I guess I do. He can block him and chain him into him or not. Yeah, I think so. Seeing as his strength for badass. He's a badass. He should have gone for the loner there, shouldn't he, I think. Yeah, that's the thing, isn't it? I mean, <laughs> it probably just does mean I'm going to lose another Saurus. That's true. <laughs> Other crops. <laughs> Yeah, he obviously was he was the Lupac school of both down and no balls, wasn't he? And that's the thing, by having both of these guys, a strength four and a strength three, you can only block one of them, can't you? With the players that he had. You couldn't block both. So that's why I thought it was good to tie him up on him. Oh 
Oh, Teddy Tom, it's going okay. Not hating Blood Bowl today so far, despite getting beaten up by fucking humans. I'd love to go for a handoff to a Saurus, but can't really. Can't really, can you? I <laughs> take ages as well. Tab out, play Crusades of the Lost Idol. That's the answer. <laughs> One dies power to death incoming. <laughs> oh, fuck. Do you know what? That was that was my fault. Because the Crocs just didn't need to didn't need to stop his ogre doing anything. Even if he had stood up and gone to there, what's it matter? He could have just I could have just brought him back. There was no danger of him. Okay, maybe he was gonna make these GFIs then. But you know, I probably didn't need to have him face the down guy. Yeah. Apple fail. No, I'm pretty much. Oh, thanks for the auto post, Kelsey. This means I've pretty much almost got the score this turn, doesn't it? Um, or rely on a dodge, but then he can just blitz, three dice blitz with an ogre and uh, base the ball. <sighs> I guess I could leave the ogre based up on a skink, but then he gets to, uh, and then he gets to three dice splat split skink, doesn't he? No, one was badly hurt. Uh, this one was was badly hurt. He's missing this game. He's missing this game. So he could go one, two, three, four, five. He could go two forward, and he could just stay on based on him. Kill a three D. But then I'll still have to score the turn after. I can't stall out the whole half. I don't think. So I'm not going to risk a 1 in 9 or 1 in 27. Or am I? Yeah, okay, I am. Let's go for a touchdown foul. Slightly suboptimal player here. Oh, he's a bludger as well. Shit. I'm probably not going to knock over the bludger, so go for this guy. There you go. Reroll gun. Powered him anyway. It was a stupid. I didn't follow. Idiotic to not follow. But I got my I got my touchdown foul that I craved. 
got a stone. See, I mean, that was a terrible, that was a terrible block. I would never have done it if I couldn't have made a touchdown pass. So, really dumb, dumb block. It wasn't punished. I lost a reroll. I just don't even have a team. It's just stupid, isn't it? It was terrible not. That was a, that was a really dumb play, but I just wanted to do the touchdown foul. You know how it is. Probably just lose this game now. Cheers, Calcio. Fuck off, Batch. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't even have to hunt them now. <laughs> Three skinks down is no problem, to be fair. You only need one skink to win. On no skinks now that I'm 1 0 up. So if I was down three skinks, I wouldn't even care. But yeah, down th down two Saurus and a Crocs. <laughs> it's fucking brutal. Yeah, Saurus thrower, holy shit. Presumably they exist, seeing as these are Saurus blockers. And Beastmen runners, oh my god. The new names are just the worst. The worst thing about Blood Bowl 2016. And seeing as how bad the rules are in Blood Bowl 2016. You know that's fucking bad. <laughs> Crocs are high block. Oh shit. Are you playing the final tomorrow? Holy shit. So, Ducky, just to clarify, that's that's 1,300 for you, right? You know that. You know that's 1,300 for you, right? Birds. Fucking hell. Another easy win. Another easy win for Ducky. I mean, that's just unwinnable for Burts. <laughs> no, right, I'll I'll do the comment. Do you want to do the commentary on the final flash? I would get on your level. You know, I'd get on your level if this didn't happen, Ducky. <sighs> I just... I can't outbash anyone. I can't outbash a fucking paper bag. My Chaos, Killer Chaos with three tackle, got outbashed by Inarian in the semi-final. Still only lost in overtime. Thanks to a one turn. After getting outbashed by Wood Elves. So, I just want to fucking smash the fuck out of everybody like you do easily every single game. I don't know how it works. Just don't know how. <laughs> don't know how Armour 9 is actually Armour 9 for you. <laughs> and Mighty Blow is Mighty Blow for you. <laughs> and Dirty Player is Dirty Player for you. It's pretty amazing. <laughs> <laughs> For me, everything's armor seven, <laughs> and mighty blow gives my opponent armor ten. <laughs> Fucking hell! Good play of him to not to not give the ball to a dodge player. And not blitz with a mighty blow player. <laughs> Ultimately bad move by him, that, wasn't it? <laughs> I guess he gets to skill him up. That's how confident he is of winning. What a dirty dingo.
That's about as dirty a potato as it gets, isn't it? He passes it to somebody who then blitzes. Doesn't choose the blodge mighty blow guy. Still probably scores. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to know it, don't I go? It was funny with my chaos that everybody else had... Uh, every other chaos team had like twice as many cards as, they, as they'd received and mine had been outbashed. <laughs> I was like, the fuck is this? He's going to make a dodge here, hasn't he? Or a one dice block. But if he scores here, it's my fault for wasting that reroll just to get a touchdown plan. I was, and I was being a bit of a dickhead, I was a massive dickhead. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, oh, can you see that guy when he had that guy anyway? All I'm gonna get is a one dice on him, isn't it? Maybe. Yeah, it was dumb. And um, only a one in nine chance of trading a reroll for a bribe. So yeah, it wasn't so. It wasn't such a bad. Uh, it wasn't such a bad decision, but. Uh, yeah, humans forced to score by casting my uh, casting my crocs and then making two GFIs. I didn't know calcium, but I saw that. I saw that Mayweather, not Mayweather. Oh God, he's 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 fuck it up. I saw McGregor had his fuck you uh, suit, which was funny if you like that sort of thing. Hmm. Yeah, I fucked up by using that reroll, haven't I? One dice for a push. Dodge. Into there. Oh, I got lucky. Giving up a mighty blow block on a skink, it's worth it though, isn't it? To, uh, to stop the touchdown. Mayweather is the uh, best boxer of all time, and Conor McGregor is somebody who can't box. <laughs> so, um, it's interesting, isn't it? Yeah, Mayweather's a prick as well, that's true. Oh yeah, typical. Incidentally, McGregor's planned for the fight, yeah. Um, no, I don't, I don't agree, Stotty. I think I think Mayweather would have a fucking decent chance of winning in an MMA fight, to be honest. Because if he if he got to punch McGregor once with, with MMA gloves, he would knock him the fuck out, wouldn't he? So there would be a chance of him landing a shot. McGregor has about as much chance of beating Mayweather as I have of beating Mayweather. 
And I know that's a slight exaggeration, but it's only a slight exaggeration. But the thing is, there's just literally no, uh, there's no fucking, there's no point even debating the, the fight, because all it is is just a fucking money-making scheme, isn't it, for those two, and they just want people to talk about it, so I'd rather just not, um, not, I would rather not, uh, not talk about it, but he does like the stand-up game, but he could still get knocked the fuck out, couldn't he? That's the thing. <laughs> you know, if you, I don't know if you saw, there was that, uh, <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know if you saw that thing, what was it? Was it James Tony? was it? He did, he did, uh, he did MMA, and, you know, sometimes, sometimes he punched people. And, and knocked them out, obviously. <laughs> so, he would have a chance of hitting the great. If he hit. Mayweather would get destroyed by a kick, but if he punched him once, he would win, wouldn't he? That's the thing. Yeah, he did, but against, against Tim Sylvia, he punched him once and knocked him out. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, how much do I get if I lose Fash <laughs> which one as well she lost a couple didn't she she lost two or three in a row and then just quit do you mean the uh, the one who kicked her in the face 100k to train I'd take the 100k to train yeah that'd be alright wouldn't it I'd take that yeah, Holly, uh, Holly Holm. Yeah, I'd, I'd take, I'd take a hundred k for Holly Holm to knock me out. <laughs> Might even win because she's a girl. So there you go. <laughs> it would be amazing, Calcium. It would be proper amazing. <laughs> All right, Fash. <laughs> really, Pedro? Wow, that hurts. Yeah, to be fair, 12 months of training, I think I could beat any girl in the world at anything. <laughs> Maybe not something intellectual. Yeah, that'd be fair, just Joe, yeah. Take the 100k, don't train at all, and then just get knocked the fuck out. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh man, did well a woman a woman played a man in tennis one time, didn't they? But it was uh but what happened was the guy was retired and she was the best in the world in her prime. So you know <laughs> no, I think she won, didn't she? I thought she won. Unlimited funds of training. Oh, I don't know, I'd probably just die from all the cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, ages ago, it was Billie Jean King, wasn't it? Ages ago, and she was like the number one versus a retired dude who was old as fuck. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. But I don't know if there's been one since then. But that was the one I was thinking of.
Yeah, exactly, Jam Toast. That was the one. <laughs> I think any any professional male tennis player would beat the Williams sisters. Novak Djokovic versus Lina. Um, Djokovic clowned to the amusement of the crowd and at one point swapped places with a ball boy. Lee was giving a 30 nil advantage at the start of each service game and won 3 2. <laughs> oh man. That's brilliant. We asked Andy Murray about playing Serena Williams and she said. That would be fun. I doubt I'd win a point, but it'd be fun. <laughs> That's brilliant. McEnroe. McEnroe thought he'd be he thought he'd beat Serena when he was fifty six. <laughs> but not in a boxing match. That's fair enough. She's a fucking she's a powerhouse, isn't she? Serena, holy shit. I mean, there's no pro tips to be had now, is there? It's pro tips how to get absolutely fucked by the dice. Skill up. <laughs> oh, God, it's so good. Oh, what's this? Number two hundred and three. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. <laughs> so I think just 2D is 2D, 2D, isn't it? Nothing to do. I don't know what I can do here. I don't know what I can possibly do. A strength difference. Don't say that. Women are equal. I, I could too. But I guess that was already after. That was after she lost though against the uh, guy though, wasn't it? What a dumb. What a dumb game, eh? Could be anyone outside the top 200 in the CCL just making one day flex. 
That's brilliant. Oh my god, yeah, the, <laughs> the ladies' football teams are absolutely, absolutely terrible. They're so unbelievably terrible. Um, I posted it in Discord. There was, uh, there was, like, the world champion team lost the world, champ world champion women's uh, American, American, like, American national team world champions lost to the fucking trainees under under 16 trainees at some like uh, MLS team which is pretty crazy isn't it Oh, but as serious as like when Wales play England and don't beat them 7 0. <laughs> you know, there you go. There you go. Thank you for that, Chantos. I mean, you know, in England don't have a friendly against. against. Uh, I, what? It? it was the. It was crap. Finland or Iceland, no, it was the San Marino. England don't lose 5 2 against San Marino in a friendly, do they? Doesn't happen. So. But yeah, infrastructure and uh, and uh, money are yeah, fair enough. But like, because you know, they shouldn't be worse at darts and snooker, should they? But yeah, when you think how many how many women play darts and snooker compared to how many men do and stuff like that. And golf as well. No, I don't know. Maybe there's some strength in golf, seeing as, uh, see as, seeing as everyone's jacked, aren't they? Seeing as everyone's on rides, seeing as all the men who play it are on rides, maybe, maybe they sh they can't be as good at that. But um, you'd think they'd be better than they are at darts, definitely. Darts, they're definitely. And they play a lot casually, don't they? Like they're often good at they're, good, they're often good in clubs. Women are often good in like darts clubs. Yeah, yeah, they're all jacked, aren't they? When you look at uh, what's he called? Tiger was on rides, wasn't he? And the other, the other one, the uh, like the Irish guy. But there's, there's a lot of women play darts, honest, I don't know, In England, anyway. In England, there's a lot of women play darts. I was, I, I, I was on a, I was on a pub team. And, uh, and you know, there was, there was a few teams where a woman was the best player. A woman was the best player on the team I was on as well. But, uh. 
I mean, Q power is is a thing in in snooker, isn't it? But I think that's more technique than actual strength. Yeah, exactly, Jelly. I mean, it's fair enough tennis, obviously. It's fair enough tennis, and things like that. That is really weird, yeah. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Yeah, I think it's amazing when they, like, they argue for equal pay in tennis and it's like... They're lucky, they're lucky they get their own competition, aren't they? <laughs> I don't really know what I can do. I can make loads of three plus dodges, I guess. Maybe though, Stotty, but uh, it's an eye play, so maybe you're not. <laughs> That's funny, but smashing weightlifting records. I wonder if there's some guys that would just would just get the operation just to just to be the champs. Probably, t probably would. Some would. When you see how like competitive some of the uh, sports people are. There's probably some that would do it just literally to uh to get it. Yeah. But it's true, but it's true though, isn't it, Skurometsu? It's just literally true. It's literally true, it's not being sexist or anything. It's just true facts. Dodges gonna make that's four. That's three. That's four. So this way is the best, isn't it? Gotta be. Yeah. Oh man, banged on. Go for him. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, endurance running there they're all they're always really skinny, aren't they? Nah, 
It's, it is true. It's absolutely true. Just because of the physical disparity, that's it, isn't it? I'm not saying that they've got better hand-eye coordination when it comes to, like, tennis. Or they've got more determination or, or anything like that. Or more, more skills. They just literally, there's the physical disparity between genders. And yeah, sure, there's the other things. But you just literally cannot argue with the physical disparity, can you? There's no... There's no argument to be made there. Unbelievable, isn't it? Might be able to box this in completely, though. Winning would be hilarious, wouldn't it? I imagine I'm going to make, like, fail the last dodge or fail the last GFI or something. A real powers on the last... The last hit. Something like that. He could, if I was him, I would have tried to just fully box box in the skink. No, but then I guess I could have surfed him maybe. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Doesn't matter which way I go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. GFI, GFI, so can't score. Make a blitz and then mark. That's three to go that way. And just give up a blitz. You, just, you get three dice blitz though then. If you go right, you get three dice blitz. There's no... There's no doubt about getting three dice blitzed, is there? So you have to be away from these guys. <laughs> Fail the fucking blow. Oh, Look, <laughs> he's getting my life. <laughs> Didn't make the surf. Dirty dingo. <laughs> yeah, Mo. I'm gonna go and play cross out after this. That's just stupid, isn't it? 1 in 81 block. 
Yeah, I, I, I do want to just run right, because if you run right, you're giving up a 3 DD. If I've made the, made the knockdown there, or even the push, and then base two guys here, and then gone down in the corner there, I think he could have only got two dice. I mean, sure he's going to have block. But, I mean, he's going to have two dice if he's blocked, no matter what you do. So I'd rather be further down the pitch. But I don't know. It doesn't mean that, does it? <laughs> Yep, two Saurus. No, three Saurus. And, uh, uh, and a skink. <laughs> what a fucking game, eh? Against humans with one mighty blow. <laughs> like the Dark Elves that got ruined by the chaos <laughs> with nothing. <laughs> well, okay, technically two mighty blows if you count the ogre. But um, it's just crazy, isn't it? Yeah, you get load up the stream more. I'll host you afterwards. I know I'm gonna carry on streaming, so I can't. But go to Mull's channel if you wanna watch Blood Bowl afterwards. Cheers. God. Bad crack in it. <laughs> and it's just. It's it's kind of truthful laughing. I mean, it's just, it's just silly, wasn't it? Maybe I should have saved the wizard. Maybe I should have let him score and then uh, and then try to win two one. Then I would have still had the wizard for this, and then maybe I could have done something. But Gotta make it a minus two instead of a minus three D. Oh, how unlucky can you get? I'll re-roll it. Another chance for minus two. It wouldn't be bad if I had strip. Wrestle strip, he would have got the ball. Oh no, he's good. He's a thrower. <laughs> but if it was a wrestle strip, <laughs> and it was somebody who didn't have sure hands. <laughs> It would have worked! <laughs> oh, More chance of that working than the uh, than the fucking Saurus fail in his block, isn't it?
Yeah, yeah, Nurgle aren't a good 2 1 team, to be honest. Because base score, you're going to struggle to get one. You have got to um, Well, early on, you're going to struggle. Later on, once you've got good pass to go, uh, they become more of a 2 1 team. <laughs> Friendly power. Locks your hands to head. Uh, yeah, you could go guard, then he's a mobile guard on defense, isn't he? Because um, he's not really a fucking ball carrier because he's so shit, isn't he? So you could go. You could go. Um, like if he had dodge, then you could go foul up here and offend. But um, seeing as he's a shithead without dodge. Um, maybe tackle with, with the uh, two heads. Maybe, maybe foul appearance. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Um, I'm pretty sure. What's he called? Harness on fumble. I'm pretty sure he took foul appearance. Well, I'm not pretty sure. I know he took foul appearance, and he. he I'm, but I'm pretty sure he liked it. On his, uh, he had. Eight, eight, three, four, eight. So we've got like two movement and one edge and block your hands. So he only got like three normal skills, and it was like I think it was his legend skill, and he took foul appearance. So, um, you, know, you can't argue with foul appearance there. But on the other hand, he's not really a ball carrier because he's a shithead. So. If he had a stat, I'd say he'd foul appearance. But he'll just be, as it is, he'll just be a block guard, two heads guy who has short hands for your offensive ground. Who has short hands against against Rebels. Basically. Yeah, tackles a good shout with having the with having the uh, two heads. Depends what you need, I guess. Depends who's in your division and what have you. You generally need tackle earlier in schedule leagues because you know you're going to have to play. You know, if you're in this league of loads of dark elves, you know you're going to have to play them and stuff, don't you? Whereas on ladder, you know you're mostly going to be playing bash teams, and you have to. You have to have. Uh, you have to have all the guard. Um, so there you go, that was pretty good wasn't it, movement 9 there on him, with sidestep, good one turning guy, but once again, got <laughs> two missed next games, <laughs> what a stupid match, and a, and a dead skink, and can't buy, an, I would, well, if this had been a skillless Saurus, and I had 80k, I would have just bought a new Saurus to not miss him. But, obviously, and if I was carrying on playing the team, but the team's dead with a loss. So there you go. What, what, a, what a terrible little run. Typical, typical pro tips team there. Killed in three games. Got outbashed every game. Well, no, I think I outbashed the... Uh, unbelievably, when I had two Saurus missed this game is when I outbashed Undead, wasn't it? But, uh, yeah, banged on all in the other two games. Banged on against Wood Elves. Outbashed by Wood Elves and Humans. And outbashed... Undead, which is just crazy, isn't it? The one team that should have outbashed them just got smashed to pieces. And the two teams they should have smashed to pieces outbashed them. Kit failed a couple of Saurus dodges into Kaz. Horrible. Yeah, that is that is a good that is a good pro tip. If all your players get Kaz, you're gonna struggle. 
<laughs> right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.